Hi, I'm Tim Scott from rvdaily.com.au. I'm here with the Cobb Scout, which is the newest Cobb camper model. It's a forward fold camper and it's the lightest forward fold Australian made camper on the market. It's a value pack proposition. It comes in at $29,990. What do you get for that money? Well, let's go and find out. And as with all Cobb trailers, they're off-road capable. As you can see, this one's equipped with mud terrain tires, it's backed with 10 inch electric brakes on there and underneath here are single shock Alco leaf spring suspension to make sure that it handles whatever you throw at it. The focus of outdoor living here is the kitchen. There's a beautiful stainless steel kitchen here, a three burner cooktop on the top with a not only the fold down lid but you've got a uh, clip in uh, wind protector here. And over here is another flip top lid for the sink bring the tap up like that. It's all plumbed in for water and gas and the uh, water tank is a hundred litres so plenty of capacity for uh, oh, pretty much camping wherever you like. As we said the kitchen is already plumbed in here. You've got a push-on connector for your water, a bayonet connection for your gas there and see a nice little touch there. These all live in there when they're stored away um, and the power lead goes through there to plug into a merit socket on the other side. Now a nice little touch here is if you can see this blank in there, that's the option to put another gas bayonet in there so you can run that away to uh, a Weber or a portable barbecue that you might have over here as well. So there you go, all ready to go and that lives inside a nice little sturdy locked compartment so it's all safe and protected when you're on the road. Now inside this hatch and you will notice all these hatches have got great ceilings on them. Now the electrical nerve center you've got your override um, on and off, your safety switch, your water tank gauge, your 105 amp hour um, AGM battery in the back and there is option to specify another one in there hence the space. Um, the only option here is the 240 volt charger which is part of the power pack option which gives you the two interior reading lights and twin USBs either side of the bed. Otherwise that's the electrical nerve centre as you would buy straight from Cub. So I'll seal that up. There you go. And in here behind this large door we've got an equally large storage area. Plenty of room to uh, keep whatever you like in there and another one here but this shows that this leads through to the tunnel storage there for the awning poles which we'll see later. Moving on to the drawbar area, standard stone guard, standard jerry can holders, although you will have to buy your jerry cans, standard gas bottle there with the option um, facility to put another one on the other side. Moving along to the drawbar, as you'd expect from Cobb, it's all Australian steel. It even tells you because it says made in Australia right there. Alco coupling, Alco jockey wheel, and nice little hooks for the chains back here. Have a look at that. Sit nicely in there. And the winder for the roof, which we'll show you shortly. Now in here, we have 1400 millimeters of storage drawer. Look at the size of that. And it's all carpeted in the bottom. So that's tremendous. Now you have to remember to lift these. It's as snug as anything. Now moving along to the next one. Shut this one up here. I do. And this is your fridge storage here. Now this slide here is holding an 85 litre Evercool but that's not the biggest that this will hold. It will hold much bigger fridges than that. That's just what this unit is fitted with. On the inside, beautiful, well-lit, seven windows in this wax converters tent section. Comfortable interior here. You'll see five, six people around here. As far as sleeping goes, this area here can be converted to uh, another bed if you wish. You can actually option a pedestal table to go in here, which would make uh, another option if you want to bring uh, children with you um, or you have an occasional guest um, to stop over. Um, underneath here, as you can see, storage on both sides. Nice little touch that these have got gas strut assist to hold them open. It's not something you find very often. 
Here I'm enjoying the view, but I'm also enjoying the comfort of this medium density queen size foam mattress. The reading lights you can see here have got twin USBs beneath them there. And they're one of the options you can specify. And below me here is a nice touch. Look at all these storage pods you've got along the front here that are, there. everything's held in place by this nice little security mesh. And then you've got these carpeted storage areas in here. They've got one, two, three, four, five, six of those. And even as you set the foot out of bed, you have a step. There you go, to make getting in and out just that little bit easier. You've got more lighting options here. As you can see, a switch for floor lighting. And also this round light here that has a night light or bug unfriendly option. And off. Cool. The awning you see here with these great clipped together poles is the standard awning that you, comes with the Cub Scout. But if you uh, want to talk other options, other options are available, including annexes and annex walls.